She became a member of the Canadian mm -hmm. Children's mm -hmm. Book Center. She became a member of Canscape. And any space that I go or I've been to, Nadia is there because she has an interest in furthering herself to be more and a more effective writer and to also to be part of the networks of the publishing industry. So that really impressed me about her. The thing that really impressed me too this weekend is like Nadia went to Abu Dhabi, flew all the way back to come back to represent her word on the street. Her social media skills is extremely savvy. But my point is, some years ago she came and just like a number of you, she had an idea. She had something she was passionate about, and it, this was Malika's costume. Nadia is also a teacher who teaches the primary grade. She's also bilingual. And so over a process of time, again, speaking back to storytelling, she had the opportunity to engage with her students around the story, to hear their reaction and to see it with the story. And so she approached Groundwood, and hey, the bell went off. It was her day, and her time, and that manuscript. <laughs> And here comes Malika's costume. Every year, uh, a different book list and the Black and Caribbean Book Affair, we acknowledge people from our community or in the community who have done great things in writing, whether it be fiction, nonfiction, whether it's their scholarly work, etc., etc. Uh, all of is one of our past recipients of what we call My People's Award. And so, Nadia is not with us. She's going back she's going to Abu Dhabi. There you go, right? <laughs> but you know, she promised me she's going to fly back again, right? But she also sent a sister friend, a sister by the name of DeAndre Mitchell, hmm. who is videotaping all of this because, you know, Matt is going to say, hey, I need to put it up on WhatsApp. social media. And Open DeAndre is trying to ask the sister over there in the corner, could you continue recording because my moment is now approaching. Open your WhatsApp. So, I put the speech because, in your WhatsApp so I can read from there. Nadia's um, work because of her tenacity, because of wanting to go more beyond what she knows already and to network, and because of producing a wonderful book that she continues to animate. She does uh, activities with kids. I mean, I've seen Girlfriend do a million things just to animate this book and to get it out there into the consciousness of families. And so, presented to Nadia Hahn for her contribution to children's literature, a different book list, October 2016. And Deandre is here to receive it on behalf of Nadia. So it's a great pleasure, Deandre, that I give that to you. Thank you. Um, Nadia has sent me a message. She's really, really upset that she's not here. Um, so she's been, you know, WhatsApping me and sending me messages all day and last night. Okay. So I have uh, a written message from Nadia on behalf yes. of her. Um, she says, greetings to everyone. Ida, Miguel, a different bookless staff and community. It gives me great pleasure to receive the People's Award for Excellence as a new author of children's literature. Thank you for seeing me and my work as, as worthy of this award. I'm pleased to be recognized in this capacity by such an institution as a different book list. And you, and as you as the, as, sorry, as, 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 and in the community. A different book list has played a pivotal role in my development and practice, not only as an Afrocentric teacher, but also as a children's book author. From How to Get Published Workshops in 2011, where I met up my publisher, Sheila Berry, to hosting a packed Soka Field Carnival themed book launch for Malika's costume. <laughs> to reviewing the book's glossary to ensure that Kaiso, Jambalasi, and Mokonjambi are defined correctly. A different book list has been there for me and many black authors in Canada, diversifying our liter literary landscape from the very beginning. It's a place where stories like my story of a poor, barrel child living with her grandma in the Caribbean who really wants a carnival costume and the money from her mother in Canada that does not come through can be shared. I have many more stories to come to celebrate our heritage, and I love knowing that there's a home for them right here amidst other writers of the Caribbean African, African diaspora and the world. Thank you again, different book lists and community, for your recognition and your continued support. Although I'm 12,000 kilometers um, from, although I'm 12,000 kilometers uh, for the time being, please look forward to more books from me. Mm -hmm. uh, for me. Thank you again. Uh.
Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Sorry. And also, I'm also a teacher too. And as a teacher, um, it, I love coming to this bookstore, and I love bringing in you know authors from various backgrounds into our classroom. And I, and I would love to see more of it happening. It just makes me very happy. So thank you, and all of you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.